Hi, it's Rob from Walland Homes, and today I'm over at our Heat Street project to talk about how we make a nice, secure floor system when installing a new floor between two masonry walls. Right here, we've got about a 21 foot span across from exterior wall to exterior wall. So, what we wanted to ensure was that we had uh, an engineered joist that had eno uh, enough structural load capacity to span unsupported that whole 21 feet while uh, still having a little bit of room extra because ultimately you never know what's going to be loaded on top if you have any heavy furniture or any ad any additional load. So you always want to give yourself a little bit of playroom with your span, uh, your span capacity. So in this case, we've got a span of 21 feet unsupported. So we went with a TGI joist. It's 14 inch thick uh, from top to bottom and that actually has uh, a span capacity of 22 and a half feet. So you've got an extra foot and a half of span capacity. You never want to be too close to the edges of your span. So if we, let's say, had a, a 21 foot span and the joint uh, span capacity was only 21 foot two or 21 foot three, you're really pushing the limits there. So you don't want to cut it too close. So we went with a joist uh, that has a 22 foot, sorry, 22 and a half foot span capacity. So that ensures that you have enough uh, capacity of these floor joists at 16 inches on center to support an, uh, sufficiently enough load on top. Then once you have your joist uh, secured firmly with your hangers and the, uh, the adhesive glue, we, uh, we, we, we install the hangers and the, the joist together, then we glue and we nail the plywood, three quarter inch plywood, which, which gives you again, more stability than a half inch or a five eighths plywood on top. Everything's squared off, everything's secured from the top down to the bottom, and everything's gonna be nice and solid. Nothing's gonna bounce or squeak or move over time. So this is how we make a nice stable floor system when we're doing a renovation like this. Thanks for watching.